It is currently the month of June, just about halfway through the year. And you know what that means. It's summer! The days are gonna be lasting longer, the weather's gonna be getting warmer, we can go to the beach and build sandcastles, ride waves, and get that gorgeous dark colored suntan that I've been waiting for all year. Except psych, because we're all stuck in quarantine from a deadly virus and all we can do is play Minecraft all day. To celebrate this exciting season, Hypixel decided that they wanted to make a new game for their server that would celebrate the summer fun. So they recreated Subnautica in Minecraft. Since summertime's here and everyone's out of school, although let's be honest, there's not that much of a difference between online school and summer vacation, Hypixels revamped the server into full-on beach mode. You go to the main lobby, bam! Giant sandcastle. Huge umbrella that kinda looks like a mushroom infestation. Simon's parked his yacht at the west end of the lobby, you know, just like a typical summer vacation. Apparently there are summer-only limited time achievements that you can unlock, and one of them is called Gone Fishing, and you need to catch 100 treasure items while fishing in the main lobby, so what you do for that is you go over by the parkour, you go down to this fishing hut over here, and then you pick up this fishing rod, 3,000, you cast it, and you fish. I mean, honestly, I don't know what I was expecting. I caught a string. What? What? I, I didn't realize it was possible to fail at fishing. Oh boy, I got 10 The Walls coins. Oh my god, my mom's gonna be so proud. Oh wow, 10 Vampire Z coins too. I'm gonna be rich. And I need to catch 100 of those. You know, I think I might just make the Hypixel Lobby my main game. Actually, if you go to the back of the main lobby, past the sandcastle and the shooting range, there's literally just a crab vibing back here. The crab rave meme died, so this poor guy had to go into hiding. Check out this bomb sandcastle. <gasps> there's a roller coaster, too. Disneyland is closed because of the coronavirus, so this is the best we got. Oh, treasure room! Give me the gold! No! I've been bamboozled! Going up to victory. Lead us to victory. What if it like went all the way around? That'd be pretty cool. <gasps> no! What is... We're gone! We're going down! It's the drop! Okay. Uh... I don't think that was supposed to happen. Did, did they forget to reset the void limit for the roller coaster? <laughs> I think they wanted to make like an epic drop, but now I just feel ripped off. So the cart like lands here. Ha, bye. You know, it was a free roller coaster, but I still feel like I got ripped off. Okay, I realize it's been a few minutes and we still haven't done anything related to Scuba Simulator. I know this is not what you clicked on the video for, because, you know, Scuba Simulator related content is just in such high demand nowadays. Scuba Simulator is the latest installment in the list of Hypixel Simulator games, like Grinch Simulator, Easter Simulator, Santa Simulator, and Hacker Simulator. And you might be saying, Oh, Omicron, Scuba Simulator is just like Grinch Simulator and Easter Simulator. You still have to go around the map and pick up items for points. However, there is one key difference between Scuba Simulator and the other simulator games. You see, the main character in the other games is kind of a douche. In Grinch Simulator, you steal Christmas presents from young children to ruin their Christmas wishes. In Santa Simulator, you sneak into someone's house and hide explosives in their stockings. In Easter Simulator, you're trespassing on private property. But Scuba Simulator's a lot different. Instead of stealing from children or trespassing, you're diving underwater to steal pirates' treasure. Now pirates, pirates are kind of jerks. Unless it's Johnny Depp or this guy, Davy Jones and Captain Hook are pretty much like bee hoppers. They mean nothing to society. Most pirates are basically just thieves. Arr, we're gonna steal all your coins. And if there's anything I've learned from property crime law under first world jurisdiction, if someone steals something and then you steal it from them, it cancels out. Hopefully. Oh look, the game just came out and it's already dying. All right, if we really wanna pop off at this game, we have to become the game itself. And this way people will be super intimidated because how are you supposed to beat Scuba Simulator at Scuba Simulator? Pretty simple, it's basically just Grinch Simulator. Gold chalices are worth one point. Gold crowns, three points. Gold pufferfish, four points. Gold slots are worth five points because Simon just has the biggest ego. All right, where's the pirate booty at? I see it. Give me that crown. I'm a king. Bam. Oh wow, it's a golden slot too. Let's go. The map is actually massive. There's so many places for like little crowns and gold things to be. Oh god, people actually have points. No. How do they have so many points? We gotta catch up. No, there's one over. There's two. I missed them. And I came in third. 
I mean, the only piracy I've ever done is internet piracy. And every single one of these simulator games, they'll usually give you some sort of projectile, like in Grinch Simulator, they give you snowballs, and in Easter Simulator, they give you eggs. But in this one, they give you a rod, which is like, let's let's bring the PvP community into this. You guys will love this because there's rods. Oh, is that a golden pufferfish? Yes! All these things belong to me. Oh god, we're being beaten by Blockbuster. Blockbuster's making a comeback. Trust me, if I was nicked as Netflix, I would have destroyed him. I like how the name of the map is Submersed because there used to be a Skywars map called Submerged and it's like Hypixel's copy in their own homework. Oh my god, there's so many gifts down here. No, I didn't get that one. Give me, give me all of these. Golden Sloth, yes. Simon be mine. Oh, Golden Crown, I'm a king. Yep, nope. Rampage. I'm gonna find so much stuff to sell on eBay. Golden pufferfish. Yes. Another pufferfish. Oh my god. Oh god. Come on. Give me the gifts. Give me them. Yes. 80 points. <laughs> and the second place person at 39. Rip. I'm so wealthy. With my newfound riches, I decided to purchase a yacht in the main lobby. So yeah. Piracy pays off. There's only one way to celebrate a victory like this. Yoinked. <laughs> no. Must get more points. No. Yes. Yes. Okay, we got it. We got it. There's a toaster here. I want to pick that up more than the other things. Omicron Gaming OP Hacker. Oh, God. He found out. How did he know? Nope. Nope. Get back. Get back. Wait, did you not... <laughs> did you not pick up the things? Do you not know how this game works? Oh, my God. We're already at 20 points. Let's go. Gold crown, I'm a king. Pufferfish, oh my god, 30 points already. <laughs> this route is so good. Nope, <laughs> get pranked, 50 points. 54 points and there's still two minutes left. I saw one out here, yep. Don't think you can hide from me, yep, you're gone. No, no, my points, my points, no, GG. I only got, what, 84 points. <laughs> And the achievement is 85 points! No! <laughs> now, I mostly play Skywars and Bedwars on this channel, and I know a lot of you are thinking, well, Omicron, why would I play Scuba Simulator? It's so boring. You just go around the map and pick up gifts, and, and that's it. But don't worry, because this clip will completely change your mind. Get ready for the biggest 1v1 in Scuba Simulator history. Eh, where is it? No, go away. No, you can't. Nope, nope. Uh -oh. Nope. No! No! Come on! Give it to me! I totally deserve this. No! <laughs> nope. No. 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 He got it! No! Alright, we're going for this. Boat skip! Yes! Mm -hmm. Grab that. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. Yes! Easy 10 points. Come on! Yeah! And we end on 69 points! Yes! That's what happens when you try to steal my crown from earlier. Alright, it's time to pop off. Let's go. Mine. Holy crap! So many! Oh! Oh! Go, 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 go! Yes! Those pirates weren't keeping a close track of their belongings, man. There's so much stuff down here. There's more crowns, too. What the hell? There's another one. Rocking the uh, 42 points. Just no, no worry about that. Nope. Don't, don't go after me. It's fine. Go away. <gasps> go away. He's targeting me. He's got the rod out. Go quick. 69. Yes. <laughs> Just barely got 60. <laughs> uh, that's nice. Hello, how are you? <laughs> oh, pufferfish. Give it to me. Yes. Yes, pufferfish. Oh my god, I love pufferfishes. Yo, Omicron, my dude, how are you? I'm doing pretty good, honestly. You know, just grabbing pufferfishes, committing internet piracy. The usual. Alright, 10 seconds left. Let's just go rod some people. Hello. Also, when you rod someone, it gives them slowness 3, which is like... Even worse than regular PvP. Even more annoying. Anyway, I'm glad I got to try out the new game Grinch Simulator. I mean, Easter Sim. I mean, Scuba Simulator. 
It was a lot of fun, but uh, I think we're gonna wrap it up there. Wait, score 10,000 points in Scuba Simulator. Oh, 